we do not support calls for an immediate ceasefire. This would only plant the seeds for the next war because Hamas has no desire to see a durable peace, to see a two-state solution. Our goal should not simply be to stop the war for today. It should be to end the war forever. When you refuse to call for a ceasefire, you are refusing to call for the only thing that can put an end to war crimes, crimes against humanity and genocide. No one should take example from the horrors of the Second World War to justify horrors today against the Palestinian people. The conditions for the effective delivery of humanitarian aid no longer exist. I urge the Council to spare no effort to push for an immediate humanitarian ceasefire for the protection of civilians and for the urgent delivery of life-saving aid. A ceasefire means that the suffering of all will carry on. A ceasefire cements Hamas's control of Gaza. Israel, Mr. President, will continue with her mission, the elimination of Hamas's terror capabilities and the return of all of the hostages. Save lives. Save lives. Save our lives and their lives. The eyes of the world and the eyes of history are watching. 